I don't think this day could get any better. I feel you on that. It's amazing to think that this tree predates New Atlantis. Mm. Can you imagine all the changes it's seen? I'm sorry, I really can't afford to be distracted. I need to get to the bottom of this. I am not staring. I am analyzing. This is important xenobiological work. I work for the scientific division of MAST. I've been studying this tree for quite some time, and it appears to be exhibiting some worrying signs. Are you familiar with this particular specimen? Do you understand its importance? I've passed by this particular tree many times, and honestly, I never gave it a second thought. Does it hold some sort of special significance? Finally, somebody understands. Unless, wait, you're not mocking me, right? <sighs> People. <sighs> Look, I have a lot of work to do here. If you're just going to gawk, I'd ask that you move on. If you can actually assist me, however, I would appreciate it. I don't normally solicit help from random passersby, but it seems an exception is necessary. Would you be willing to retrieve some additional data for me? Well, that's... thank you. That's unexpected. Ah, there's a series of biosensors I've placed in various locations around New Atlantis, all calibrated to gather pertinent information. They've been running for long enough that I think it's time to collect and analyze their findings. If you would bring them to me, that would save time. Yeah, what is it? bartender at the viewpoint would stop complaining to security. I don't know what she lost, but she won't get it back by annoying us. So I dust the last spacious ship, but then I realize my tank sprung a leak. I'm stuck.
So, what's the point? Of what? This. Is it some sort of art? A Zen garden? What? It's a communal art installation. It's supposed to look nice. I guess. But I'm just saying, you could have a whole batball field or some food stands. Something useful. Your ship that landed not too long ago? Hey, are you looking for eggs too? I've only found one so far, but I want to find more before anyone else does. So if you see some, can you tell me? Okay, thanks. Miss Seng over at UC Distribution bought the one I found, and she said she might buy more if I can find them. I could really use the credits. The FC is no friend of you and me. I'm pleased to report that our stocks are currently being maintained at 90% or higher. I'm sure we have anything you might need. Welcome to UC Distribution. Now, before you say a word, I am required to inform you that formal complaints cannot be filed until the customer feedback system is back online. I have been told it'll be up and running in two weeks, but you know how these things are. I am sorry for any potential inconvenience. Also, if you're here about a corporate account, I've been assured that deliveries will be back on schedule soon. Who, Jordan? <laughs> that kid's in here every other day with some random thing he found. Trying to get credits. Yeah, I took pity on him. Why, what is it? That so? Must mean something to you if you came looking for it. Well, you can have it back for what I paid for it, plus a little extra. Let's call it a convenience fee, shall we? I could, but I did pay for it. I'd like to recover my losses. And it's all the way in the back room. I'd have to walk back there, then back out here. You're the one who said it was junk. If that's true, why bother coming back for it at all? Pleasure doing business with you. Right, right. Come back if you need something else. By the way, Captain, Sergeant Yumi was looking for you. Sounds like you've got more work. Fill out an application to become part of the most advanced technology corporation.
I don't mean to be pushy, but I really do need those sensors, and quickly. I really do need that additional data. So you do. Wonderful. I'll just take these, and we'll see what they have to tell us. All right. We'll just upload the data and give it a moment. And just another moment. Oh, it is working, isn't it? Ah, there it is. What a relief. Now, let's see. This is... Well, it, it's... Oh, my. Well, there's good news and bad news. The good news is that my suspicions were correct. There is something wrong with the tree. I will report my findings to Mast immediately with no small amount of satisfaction. The phrase, I told you so, may even be uttered more than once. Yes, it does feel good to be right. Particularly when others have attempted to convince you otherwise. Repeatedly. The bad news, as it were, is that the internal composition of the tree is changing. In this particular case, the tree is now regularly emitting ultra-low frequency sound waves. They're nearly imperceptible now, but they're growing in strength. This is something we've never observed before. Depending on how large these waves grow, consequences for the city could be... Well, disastrous. I must consult with my colleagues in Mast at once. Thank you for your assistance. I hope these credits are adequate compensation. The data from the biosensors speaks for itself. ...and moving sermon on greed and the responsibility of man. A small gathering of Sanctum Universal faithful listen to hear them. about a million things to do and I'm only one person it's so overwhelming hey oh you're not Carl sorry I shouldn't assume maybe you go by Carl you're just not the Carl I was waiting for we're supposed to be investigating a power drain down here people have been reporting brownouts for a while and mass finally decided to follow up on it I can't be in two places at once and Carl isn't here so I'm just trying to look inconspicuous. Well, since you're here and Carl isn't, and I really want to get this solved, I will take you up on that. What I need is very technical. I can talk you through it remotely. I'm gonna head to the monitoring station. 
The first box we're looking for is over near UC Surplus. You know, Antonio's place. I can contact you once you get there. Watch your pockets around me. Just say. avoiding eye contact. It should be fine. Another switch flipped, another lead to follow. And the lights in here just flickered too. The wiring is worse than I thought. I'm going to work on fixing that little issue while you find the next junction box. Looks like it's over near the... Uh... Mm, the trade authority. Okay. Just find that and, uh... Maybe don't talk to anyone about it just yet. You won't find anything at Enrix. That place is where good selection goes to die. Okay, the final box I need you to deal with should be right around there. Unfortunately, I just realized you're in for a real tangle of gabling. Like 200 years of Phil attempts to rewire things. I tried to fix it three years back, and was crying by the second day. Gave up on the third. Anyway, there should be a series of secondary breakers you need to deal with before you can access the junction box. I don't remember the order, but flip levers until all those circuits are powered down.
You know, I went to chef school. This ain't exactly where I saw my when my luck dies. A friend of Did I say thank you? It's because thank you. There's no way I could have done that in a reasonable amount of time all by myself. Oh yeah. If they actually wanted to explore the galaxy, they would have gotten a... Uh... Well, not everyone would be. And I appreciate it. Thanks to your help, I was able to trace the power drain. I know where it's coming from. Unfortunately, the source is exactly where I was afraid it was. The Trade Authority. So, that's something that I'll need to deal with. That'll be fun. If you want to tag along, I certainly wouldn't complain. But if not, then this is where we part ways. So thanks to you, we've got evidence that the Trade Authority is behind the power drain being reported down here. I don't know if you ever dealt with the Trade Authority, but Zoe is intimidating. I have to go in there, but I really, really don't want to. You think you'd be willing to go with me? Just make sure this doesn't go badly? Thanks. That means a lot. I can do the talking, I think. Just be ready for, well, anything. Visit from Mast. How delightful. You'll have to remind me of your name, dear. I'm afraid I can't keep track of all you little. Even in the well, the trade authority continues to flourish. Because I've been in Makes you sick, doesn't it? Yes, yes, of course you are. And what was it you were accusing me of with absolutely no evidence? The power drain is coming from your building, Zoe. You and I both know it, and now I can prove it. I'm sorry. What? We traced the dream, checked the grid, and let us hear. You, you can't talk your way out of this. I'm going to ask you to wait here a moment. I'll be right back. Okay, just be ready for anything. I don't know if she's going to come out of there with a gun or call in mercenaries or what. Don't worry. 
Whatever happens, we're prepared to handle the situation. I don't want this to turn out violent if we can avoid it, okay? Okay, you're probably right. Just need to breathe. Well, Miss Reyes, I apologize for not taking this matter more seriously. I assure you, I will eagerly assist in getting to the bottom of this. No, you're not weaseling out of this. We got to the bottom of it. You are the bottom. I appreciate your enthusiasm for your work, but I do a little more research before casting aspersions. Someone has indeed been using this location through which to route electrical power. It is not the Trade Authority. I've had my suspicions for a while, and I've been keeping detailed notes, which I'm happy to share with you. For now, though, what do we do next? I... Hello? Wait, what? Oh, for heaven's sake. I presume you've been assisting Miss Reyes in tracking down this little problem. Well, clearly there's more work to be done. Why don't you continue the work you've been doing with an assurance that the Trade Authority will compensate you for your time? I'll coordinate things here with Miss Reyes. With Mast's access to the grid, we'll find out who did this soon enough. And why. Presumably, you're the one who's been doing the field work, so... I believe you'll find there's another junction box out there in the well that needs your attention. Okay, well, this is not how I saw this going. For the moment, let's assume this is all legitimate. I can sort out the details with Zoe. So why don't you go investigate the next junction box? for any suspicious activity. Is that clear? And Zoe's here too, if you hadn't guessed. We've agreed to work together on this. Once you throw the switch, we can direct you to the next junction box. That's it, thanks. Let's just take a look here. Okay, you're going to want to head for box 45A. It should be near Apex Electronics. <laughs> you can't possibly be serious. Are you looking at the same diagram I am? 47B is obviously the next one. It's on the same level. I appreciate that you've listened to reason. The junction box should be just nearby. We'll have this solved in short order. Zoe, I know how to read. Ignore her. Head for box 45A, okay? Adequately done. Miss Reyes and I have both noted that the next node in this trace is not on any of the current diagrams. She means it's not in the well. It's somewhere on the surface, which technically means it's not my responsibility. However... However, we agree that we all like to see this through. If you head topside, I'll pull up the diagrams we need. Reyes is still collecting the necessary diagrams and blueprints to accurately assess the situation. Before she returns, I'm going to make you an offer. Whatever you find at the end of this path, you bring it to me first. I'll be certain that Mast gets what it needs, but I trade in valuable information. 
I suspect you're going to find some. I guarantee you the trade authority will pay well. Consider that as you head towards the residential district. We can't pinpoint the source yet, but it's somewhere over there. on the building's exterior. I'm not sure why she knows that. One never knows when information might be useful. Okay, well, we're going to discuss that later. I'll check in once you flip the switch. Well, that's unexpected. Powering down that junction doesn't show any other connections. Clearly, the source must be inside that residential tower. Yeah, that would make sense. You know, I think I remember seeing a report about power problems on one of the upper floors. I bet it's related. See if you can get up there. If you don't see what you want, feel free to ask. Hi there! How's business, Amelia? Thanks for stopping in. Really? Feel free to look around. I feel like I see I can take care of transactions, time. and if you've got questions, just ask. Oh, please, take a look. Appreciate the business. Seems like the Crimson Fleet is everywhere these days. Spread like a virus.
Where did you learn to pick a... You know what, on second thought, I don't want to know. Wasn't expecting to cliff dive today. My brother works at Scrapping. So, your file says Ronan. What does that mean exactly? He's one of those sword people. You know they make guns now, right? How are you doing? It's been a while since we had a chance to catch up. You look like you need something, yeah? So you tracked it down. You've got something to show for it? Great. I'll get this back to Mass for analysis. I'm not stupid. I know Zoe probably made you an offer. I appreciate that you didn't take it. And I'm really glad we got to work together on this. So, looks like maybe someone thought they could hack into Calibank's system. In fact, looks like maybe they did. Still want to claim you had nothing to do with this, Zoe? My dear, why in the world would I want to break the law? And Galbank, no less. I do quite enough business with them as it is. All right. Well, I'll have some people look over this. Maybe they'll be in touch. I very much doubt that. See you around.
Ah, if it isn't my favorite part-time security officer. Crime has slowed down since you started helping out, which is good for morale. Yep. Something just came in. Scuffle over at the Don's Roost. Security on site handled it, but now one of them is saying the other guy stole his wedding ring. Problem is, he left without identifying the perp, so I need you to talk to Royce Elgin at the Don's Roost. See if you can fill in the gaps. Good. Report back here when the matter's resolved. See you later. Saw your ship come in. Nice ride. I do hope you are enjoying your time in New Atlantis. There is simply no parallel to the food you will find here. One taste, and I'm sure you'll agree. Ah, uh, a most unfortunate incident. Complicated by the fact that both parties were inebriated. While I wasn't privy to the entire argument, Hugo and Octavio have been dining here together for quite some time. So, it was surprising to see them at each other's throats. I assume that would be the slender gentleman, Hugo Fournier. He was the one who excused himself after UC security arrived. I believe he lives in Athena Tower, although he may be checking out soon, but I would start there. Enjoy the rest of your day. Hello. Oh, I can't believe that Octavio, that liar, that manipulator, that, that. Yes, the man who, wait, what? He's accusing me of theft? The nerve of that Lothario. Five years we were together, half a decade. And he threw it all away for that waiter! It was supposed to be a romantic dinner. Our last, before we pledged our lives to each other. But an hour before, I decided to do some cleaning to calm my nerves. I picked up a pair of pants he left on the floor and... Out falls a napkin from the dawn's roost with a number written on the back. To think he had the audacity to schedule a date with me at the same restaurant? I was livid! Still, 
I went to the date and held it together just long enough for the waiter to serve us, then I went off! He would say that, but as far as I'm concerned, it's my property. He gifted it to me when he proposed. It's not his to return. I don't care. I'm not giving it to you. Well, I was going to pawn it off. But what if I don't get a good price? And every second with it is excruciating. Ugh. Fine. I may be extremely agitated, but I want no part of a UC prison. Here. How can I help you, Captain? Captain. Ah, oh, perfect. Did you manage to get the ring back? Excellent. I'm sure the victim will be pleased to know their property has been returned. You acquitted yourself well again. I dare say you might have a knack for police work. Hardly surprising for a captain of the UC Vanguard, but still, impressive nonetheless. Here, take this. It's well deserved. need a programmer on board, but their shipboard system literally uses quantum synergy software. Can I help? Huh. Well, isn't this a pleasant surprise? I hadn't expected to run into you again. Indeed I am. The success of my previous venture, with which you so kindly assisted, has been brought to the attention of Mast. There is growing concern. Oh my. A bit of an unintentional pun, isn't that? Well, concern that things are going to get worse. The data we gathered points to a definitive trend. The vibrations coming from this tree are increasing in strength and frequency. Because we've never seen this before, not on this scale, we have absolutely no idea what the upper limit is. We don't know when or even if this will stop. It's imperceptible by normal human standards now, but given time, 
While I hesitate to speculate on the possibilities, well, none of them are good. I am attempting to formulate one, yes. But until I have all of the relevant information, it is impossible to do so. There is data regarding other, younger members of the species. Unfortunately, there are some, shall we say, personal issues with acquiring it. <clears throat> per per personnel issues, if you understand me. What? No, that is ridiculous. I am a professional. One of the other researchers in MAST, Emilio Hadek, has research I believe could be vital to my work here. He and I don't see eye to eye, and so far he's refused to turn it over to me. I'm hoping that if someone else were to ask, he might be more inclined to relinquish it. What do you say? Oh, thank you. Uh, last I knew, he was on a field assignment somewhere near the outskirts of the city. Uh, perhaps it's best if you don't mention my name in the process? Wen really keeps the distribution center in tip top. Something you need? Take your time. Mind your step. Important research happening here. <sighs> Could you stand a little to the left? I think you're blocking my readings. Trees. Uh, I see what's going on here. You're working with Kelton, aren't you? Nice try, but it's not happening. No. No way. Kelton is actively ruining my career. There's no chance that I'm helping him with anything. Whatever this thing is he's on about, he's just doing it to make himself look good with the higher-ups. I'm not helping him with that. <laughs> right. Of course, we're all in danger. Trees are involved, after all. Uh, he really won't let this go, will he? Hmm. Maybe I can make this work in my favor. Okay, you know what? I'll hand over the data. But I'm only going to do so after you've helped me secure a better position in MAST. Wait, really? Wow. Okay. Okay! I've gotten a few bad performance evaluations in the last couple of years. Totally unjustified, incredibly unfair. I found a backdoor into the mass network so I could make some changes to my personnel file. But it turns out the chief engineer knows what she's doing. The only way to get access is from the terminal in her apartment, which is kind of... locked. Sorry, that's not on the table. There is, and I already explained exactly what it is. Advancing my career is the right thing to do, so that's what I'm focused on.
Hey, take it easy. Okay, look, look. Just hear me out, all right? I really need this to happen. If you do this for me, I can make it worth your while. You delete that data, I get promoted, I'm pulling in a bigger salary. I can compensate you. I'll throw in some extra credits for you, okay? A nice little bonus. But first, you need to get into the chief engineer's apartment. Fine, fine, you win. Just get out of my sight. And tell Kelton to stuff it. Yeah? All right, let's go. I hope you have the data. It's really quite crucial. That he is. I'm sorry that you had to put up with him, but this data is vital. I'm sorry if this was complicated. I'd prefer to remain unaware of the details in the event that it comes up later, particularly in a legal setting. And I suppose I'd better verify the data to make sure Emilio didn't double-cross me. But you have once again come through for me. I'm truly hoping that this is the last piece I need to figure out what we can do. And I appreciate it. Thank you for your assistance. Security scanners, chemical sniffers. Hmm. The United Colonies sure isn't taking any chances. Howdy. Hey there. Always nice to see a new face. First time in New Atlantis? <laughs> oh boy, I didn't mean for you to take it personally. It's just something that's the customers. Break the ice, know what I mean? Listen, you just relax. Make yourself comfortable. You're welcome to stay as long as you want. That work for you, new guy? Let me know if there's anything I can get you. Yep, spaceport traffic keeps me pretty busy. But just between you and me, I've got something in the works that'll change everything. A new drink that'll make this place famous, galaxy-wide. You would love it, I guarantee. Only, I can't make you one right now. Don't have the ingredients. I made a deal with the hauler to bring me some small samples of an ingredient I think will make all the difference. But it never showed up. Turns out the guy I hired was also hired by a few other folks. The kind of folks who ship less than legal cargo. 
Security got wind, and the whole lot was impounded. Now they're just sitting on it, taking their sweet time like they always do. It's killing me. Very clever of you. Your parents must be so proud. And really? I'm not even certain this is what I need to finish the recipe. I just... I think it is. I need to get my hands on that cargo. I really do. It's gonna keep me awake nights if I don't try. Before we say anything else, I am in no way asking you to do anything that might violate any of the many, many laws in place here in New Atlantis or the larger United Colonies. This is just one friend talking to another friend, asking if maybe that friend could possibly find a way to get her important cargo out of the impound. And if, hypothetically, that were done in a less than 100% legal way, well, that might not be the worst thing in the world. You, uh, with me on this? Surely you're not seriously considering this course of action. The last thing we need is UC security on our backs. Yeah, sure. Right. Okay. I totally get it. I can't even believe I suggested it. I can wait the 18 months until they release it. Probably. It'll be fine. Just... If you change your mind, let me know, okay? See you around. Hey. What can I help you with? No problem. Hey there, new guy. Hope life is treating you well. Let me know if I can get you anything. The ways of New Atlantis security are inscrutable to mere mortals. They always appear busy, and yet somehow nothing ever seems to get done. Yes, I'm still missing my ingredients. And yes, I am quite bitter. I can only hope you are bringing up this deeply painful subject because you've had a change of heart, and now are considering some mild law-breaking. Oh my gosh, you will? Really? Wow. Okay. Do we, like, conspire now or something? I don't really know how criminal activity works. Not that this is criminal. I mean, <laughs> certainly not. First of all, I can't even tell you how much I appreciate this. Second, I have to be honest. I have absolutely no idea how to fix this. I'm obviously not expecting you or anyone to go in guns blazing and taking hostages or something. I just figure there has to be a way to get what I need. I'm not worried. I'm annoyed. Wait, are you saying I should be worried? No, of course not. It'll be fine. Totally fine. I, I trust you. Stop by any time you'd like to catch up. Excuse me. Yes? Yes? Sounds good. Lead on. I'm listening. 
Hurry back. Keep your eyes open and watch your step, okay? It's really not safe for civilians here. It's really not safe for civilians here. Got something for me? Excellent. You will be scanned as you enter the city. Please keep moving. Okay, no bounty. There's a bit more in the back, if you're not- Thanks! It's hard work, but it all pays off in the end. And I can't take all the credit. Gerhardt, my business partner, he does so much of the work behind the scenes. If it weren't for him, I don't know where we'd be now. Oh, please, take a look! Appreciate the business! Where we first met. Selling art is a bit of an art itself, you know. a strong he mind and a good eye to sell back. art. Crimson. Oh, please, take a look. Uh, 
Thanks for shopping at Jemison Mercantile. You doing okay? I know it's been a rough day. Doing okay. Keep your nose clean. Last thing I want is to charge you for a DB. That seems like a small decision, but they all add up over time and I keep paralyzed. telling them I am a manager. I should be well, managing. Well, it's coffee. Pick fun, well, get out of the way, and let this get on with our lives. Pardon. <clears throat> Hope life is treating you well. Let me know if I can get you anything. Hey there, new guy. Hope life is treating you well. Let me know if I can get you anything. Oh, no way. You really got it? I probably don't want to know what you did to get this, right? I mean, I want to know, but it's maybe better if I don't. Oh, did you? Well, I know who to go to next time I need to renew my liquor license. Well, look, I can assure this will all be worth it in the end. Matter of fact, I'm going to let you have the first ever sample. On top of that, you get free drinks. Not, not like unlimited free drinks. But you want a little pick-me-up now and then? I got you covered. I need some time to work on what comes next. But this... This was the difficult part, I think. Really? Thank you so much. See you around. Okay. Hello. You've got something for me? Head down to the spaceport and speak to Crew Chief Haroth. He'll get you where you need to go. Right. Got so wound up bringing you on board, I almost forgot. <laughs> oh, I haven't. Come on, John. Let's hear it, before you try to convince him to join the Marines. All right. Here's what I've got. Vanguard volunteer by the name of Moera. Helps patrol the old neighborhood. Sol, Mars, Neptune, you know. The Sol system? Which admiral did he upset to get that posting? He's Martian, born and raised. Not like I can get anyone else to care. Word is he's got some fancy metal ornament he's been showing off to the old grounders. Matches that description Sarah gave me. Sol system is a lot of planets. But a vet like Moera will be checking in at Sidonia on the regular. You mean hitting the bars, don't you, John? Hey, nothing wrong with a little refresh between patrols. Anything for Sarah. 
You see, always takes care of its own. Even the prodigal children. Oh, brother. Good luck out there, Vanguard. Jetpack damaged or something? Another day, another credit. I picked up something you might be interested in. <laughs> 